In this video, we'll balance the equation for C10H8 plus O2. This is a combustion reaction. We have a hydrocarbon plus oxygen, and we get carbon dioxide and water. This is the formula for naphthalene. So let's see what we can do. Let's count the atoms up on each side. 10 carbons, 8 hydrogens, and then 2 oxygen atoms. Product side, 1 carbon, 2 hydrogens, and then 2 oxygens, plus we have 1 oxygen here with the water. So we have 3. Let's just update the carbons. We could put a 10 here, 1 times 10. That would balance the carbon atoms. We do need to update the oxygens. So we have 2 times 10, that's 20, plus the 1 oxygen in water, 21. Let's update the hydrogens, because we could just put a 4 as our coefficient, 2 times 4. That would give us 8. They would be balanced. And then we update our oxygens. For the oxygens, we have 2 times 10, that's 20, plus the 4 times the 1 here, 4. We have 24, which is great because now all we need to do is take and put a coefficient of 12 in front of the O2. 2 times 12, that equals 24, and we're done. This equation is balanced. Two things to remember. One is leave the oxygen till last. That makes it easy because you have this oxygen by itself. We can change the coefficient here, and it doesn't affect the carbons or the hydrogens. The other is when you're counting up the atoms, be careful. Sometimes people count the two oxygens here, and they forget about the one in water. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for C10H8 plus O2. Thanks for watching.